The dog days of summer are upon us, which is usually a slow time for video game releases. While there are a couple of big releases coming this summer, you know, The Last of Us Part Two and Ghost of Tsushima, some of us might experience a bit of a dry spell while we wait for the holiday rush of games. So in the meantime, why not try some of the plethora of free games out there? Yes, believe it or not, there are a ton of free to play games that aren't Fortnite, Call of Duty, Warzone, or Apex Legends. The following are five free games from different genres that we personally enjoy and recommend to you. If you're in the mood to shoot a bunch of things but tired of the Battle Royale format, try Destiny 2. Now, you may have heard that Destiny 2 had its fair share of ups and downs over the past few years, but there's no denying that its free-to-play starter edition, New Light, offers some of the best value of any free game out there. You get an entire campaign from the base game, plus two expansions that can be played solo or cooperatively, and a plethora of PvP modes that are incredibly addicting. Plus, they keep adding new content all the time to keep you coming back for more. If Destiny 2 doesn't get you going, free shooters like Warframe and Warface might tickle your fancy. While the digital card game trend continues to grow at a fever pitch, Hearthstone continues to be a favorite of ours. Not only does Hearthstone have an easy to learn format and newbie friendly deck building tools, it's also supported by an ongoing seasonal structure, the newest of which is the current Year of the Phoenix. There's plenty of standard and ranked PvP action to keep you busy, but if you'd rather play solo, there's a number of single player campaigns to dig into as well. However, if you've already been there and done that with Hearthstone, some other free card games to check out include Gwent the Witcher card game, Direwolf Digital's Eternal, Magic the Gathering Arena Online, or the recently launched Legends of Runeterra. After the release of Star Wars Rise of Skywalker, Disney announced they were taking a break from Star Wars movies for a while. So if you start feeling a bit of a Star Wars withdrawal coming on, try jumping in on Star Wars The Old Republic. Star Wars The Old Republic is a free-to-play multiplayer online role-playing game that takes place thousands of years before the events of the films and places you in the middle of the battle between the Galactic Republic and the Sith Empire. Will you choose the light or will you succumb to the dark side? But hey, if you have Star Wars fatigue, we understand. Some other amazing free-to-play online RPGs that we highly suggest include EverQuest, Path of Exile, Guild Wars 2, and of course, DC Universe Online. If you're in a fighting mood, we absolutely love Brawlhalla. Similar to Nintendo Super Smash Bros, your goal in Brawlhalla is to knock your opponents off the stage, and it's super addictive. You can play the game locally or online and take on one player in a 1v1 mode or take on three players in a crazy free-for-all. While the game is simple, only needing a couple of buttons for attacks, jumping, and moving, it's all about timing and catching that opponent sleeping. Hey, we get it. The platforming fighter may not be for everyone, so if you're more into the traditional fighting games, check out the free-to-play games Killer Instinct and Dead or Alive Core Fighters. League of Legends and Dota 2 might be atop of the MOBA mountain, but Smite isn't one to sleep on. What sets Smite apart from other MOBAs is all of the game's playable champions are actually gods and deities pulled from various mythological pantheons. This means matches can involve epic throwdowns between legendary forces like Zeus, Ra, Artemis, Mir, and more. Smite also offers a unique third-person perspective wherein players move their chosen god around directly instead of pointing and clicking from on high, like in most most other MOBA titles. Now, Smite has been around since 2014, and if you feel like the game has been getting a little long in the tooth, maybe try other MOBAs like Arena of Valor or Heroes of the Storm. Now, we can go on and on about the tons of free games that we love out there, but we want to know what free games are you enjoying at the moment? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you soon.